kids i hope you all are safe and having good time children as we know we all are going through this tough time and in this tough time also our school has took the initiative of learning through technology and children i'm sure that you are all are enjoying this new way of learning okay kids so in the last video we learned about the different topics of food like nutrients balanced diet and food pyramid in this video we are going to learn some more topics about food let's see what are these topics that we are going to learn as you can see there are sources of food varieties of food and food habits that we are going to learn today so let's start first topic sources of food kids foods come from plants or animals as you can see in this picture okay and the food that we get from plant are comes from different parts of plants like stem leaves flower roots seeds and fruits we also get fruit from animals like milk meat products and eggs children let's see some examples of different parts of plant that we eat first one stems in examples ginger sugar cane onion potato and the roots second uh, examples of the roots are carrot beetroot radish turnip etc next flowers example of flowers cauliflower cabbage broccoli etc and example of leaves as you can see here spinach methi coriander etc next we'll see fruits example of fruits cherry apple mango many ma more are there as you know and the seeds that we eat they are peas cereals like wheat corn rice etc and pulses like rajma chole dal these all are seeds yes and remember this okay let's move forward children do you know that we use tomato as vegetable but it's not a vegetable it's actually a fruit yes remember this tomato is a fruit okay next see food from animals we get different varieties of food from animals and we call it dairy food sea food poultry food and the examples you can see in the picture dairy food like milk cheese and these type of food we get from cow buffalo goats etc and the next sea food we get from sea in examples as you can see in the picture fish and many more are there like uh, crabs okay next poultry food poultry food that we get from poultry farm yes uh, it's like uh, uh, people have their farm in which they keep the hens animals and animals uh, which gives eggs yes in examples like chicken eggs sauces uh, we get from pigs bacon and uh, sauces we get from fish and meat that we get from different uh, animals like um, goat okay uh, pigs also next we'll see different meals okay the different meals that we have in a day children main meals that we have in a day are three what how many three first one breakfast what is breakfast the first meal of the day in the morning is called breakfast second lunch and what is lunch the meal in the afternoon and third dinner the meal in the night okay 
as you can see in the picture also as you can see breakfast which eats in the morning lunch in afternoon dinner or um, dinner and night or we can say uh, late evening okay apart from these main meals we are having uh, some more meals like uh, snacks and brunch what is snack the small meal between lunch and dinner sometimes we feel hungry na after lunch also in the late afternoon so we eat some snacks like uh, chips and all we call that snacks okay and then brunch the small meal between breakfast and lunch yes meal between breakfast and lunch we call it brunch okay let's move forward okay as you can see here food in our country what's our country what is our country india what india and we are having different types of food in different okay as you can see in the pictures here we are having famous apple from kashmir and thepla is famous in gujarat as we uh, live in the gujarat you must uh, must be knowing that and south indian food like uh, dosa idli vada these are famous food of south india south india means uh, two three states uh, uh, that are in the south of the india like kerala andhra pradesh tamil nadu okay and here you can see uh, this mak makke and it's famous in punjab you can see here the famous food from himachal pradesh also i will zoom zoom it you can see it clearly okay this is vegetable of uh, nashpati we call it nashpati sabji and meethe chawal okay rajma rice okay so these are the different types of food that we have uh, up in our country from all over the states okay next food around the world children we have different choices and different types of food has been eaten around the world it's not same that the food that we eat and the food the people of other countries will eat. as you can see in these pictures here these are weird but uh, it's true as you can see tarantula and it's famous in cambodia which country cambodia if you see it clearly it's crabs what crabs okay i know it's weird but it's true that people are eating and this birds nest soup uh, nest soup that is famous or mostly eaten in indonesia as you can see here okay and next sushi we call it sushi and it's famous in japan next as you can see here this fried snake that chinese people eat yes and here one more mopane mopane and it is very famous snake snake of not snake snake of africa as you can see here it's actually they are eating insects yes these are the weird foods that has been eaten all around the world okay let's move forward children we eat food but we should eat the food according to our age we should know what is a uh, good for our age okay as you can see here people have different habits according to age the new ba- uh, newborn ba- baby only drinks milk till 6 months yes the newborn baby only drink milk nothing else okay not even water because the baby gets all the important nutrients from milk only 
Next, you can see here, children of your age should eat more fruits and green vegetables in their food. Why? Because it make them taller and stronger. Okay. Next, we see adults. Adults should uh, eat energy food so they can work efficiently. Okay. And old people, what old people eat? They eat lighter food. So it, uh, so it will be easy for them to digest. If they will eat heavy food, it's not possible for them at that age to digest those kind of food. Okay. So children, we should eat all the food according to our age and our efficiency. Okay. Next one. What are the healthy habits that we should have? We should follow while eating the food or while cooking the food as you can see here first one wash your hands before and after having food okay I've seen many uh, children like they eat the uh, sorry they wash the hands before eating but they don't wash the hand after having it okay next second chew your food properly okay if you not chew your food properly it will not be digested and you will have problems in your stomach okay so you have to chew chew your food properly third one keep away from fast food and soft drinks yes many of the people like to eat junk food yes but we should not eat those type of foods because it makes us sick and our health become dull next wash vegetables and fruits before before using before cooking and before eating the fruits you should wash them next one keep your vessels clean in which food is being cooked just by be food bana rahe in which ever vessel vessel you are making the food it should be clean okay and next time of having breakfast lunch and dinner should be same every day okay you should not change the timing um, of breakfast lunch and dinner sometimes you must be eating eight o'clock in the morning and sometimes uh, 11 o'clock that should not should not be that the time of your meals should be same every day okay next one do not waste the food yes you should not you should never waste the food because you are having the food but many of their uh, there are the peoples those who haven't got the food for eating okay so you should not waste the food next drink lots of water if you want that you food, your food will digest properly so you have to drink lots of water in the last video we discussed that that you should uh, drink at least 8 to 12 glasses of water daily okay let's move forward okay so we are having here home assignment yes i'm having home assignment for you you have to solve this puzzle of food safety okay as you can see here some hints also you can zoom it and read it and you can write the answers in this crossword puzzle okay